Greetings, dear diary. What is religion? Who is God? Very difficult questions. Really? No? Let's try. Let's try answering them. Many of us often believe that religion is God's way. But can the twain, religion and God, be conflated? No, not really. Because several streams, indeed main streams of some religions, do not posit God. Examples would be Taoism, uh, Buddhism, Jainism and uh, even some streams of you'd be surprised to know Hinduism. So if religion does not necessarily provide us with God, what does it provide us with? Morality? Mm, nope. Though religions invariably offer uh, rich servings of morality, that cannot be the main marker of a religion or of religions. Why? Because the moral injunctions of all religions are more or less the same. No cheating, no stealing, no killing, no lying, uh, no lying in the bed with the neighbor's wife and so on. If morality were the main defining factor of religions, we would have had only one religion in the world. Like we have only one electrical engineering in the world. Any differences would easily have been resolved through dialogue and any remaining differences would create no animosity. Like for example, 110 volts appliance users do not consider 240 volt appliance users any less holy than themselves and vice versa. So, if, if we really look into the roots of morality, we will find uh, that they lie in the evolutionary history of humankind. All social animals have their moralities, their own kind. We as humans may or may not agree, but all social animals have their moralities. So do human beings. minor variations in time, space and individuality accepted of course. What about culture, lifestyle? Well, these factors are more geographical than religious. The culture and lifestyle of say Bangladeshi Muslims is much closer to that of their Hindu counterparts, indeed to that of uh, Hindus across the border in West Bengal, India, than uh, to uh, Punjabi Muslims in Pakistan, let alone uh, Salafi ones in Saudi Arabia. Religious laws? Well, for every religious law, there generally is a more rational civil law, more in accordance with our understanding of universal human rights in today's world. 
one has then only one possibility that is every religion's basis every religion's unique fingerprint something that makes it a religion rather than any other secular rational and debatable system in its broadest sense cosmology Weltanschauung worldview or more properly uh, the most the answer to the most important question in life what is life all about yes the answer to the question what is life all about but isn't that question really in the realm of philosophy the great great grandmother of all disciplines of human knowledge but philosophy rarely gives you certainties and always requires of you a great deal of uh, troublesome thinking so people don't want to do it some do and answers provided by sometimes good at other times half baked philosophers have been simplified and packaged for masses by other wise people with along with dollops of other stuff designed to make men more peaceful and more cohesive and that amalgam is called religion so dear diary religion is nothing but philosophy light packaged for masses and god he she or it is the provisional box in which we store the questions for which satisfactory answers have not yet been found by wise philosophers and scientists so nothing wrong of course with either religion or god so long as they increase the peace inside and outside of the human heart but that so long is critically important we must junk both religion and god when they become instruments of discord well this is what i was thinking for the last few days until next time then goodbye dear diary